King Charles chose to say nothing and turn the other way ahead of Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's attacks on the royal family, according to claims made in Omed Scobie's bombshell new book. According to the journalist's juicy biography Endgame, which hit shelves on November 28, Charles instead buried his head in the sand because he was too stubborn. Scobie claims that the monarch was given an opportunity to smooth over any rifts that had arisen between the Duke and Duchess of Sussex and the rest of the firm before the release of the couple's Netflix documentary and Harry's tell-all memoir, Spare. However, he chose to let the attacks happen as he refused to apologize, The Express reports. The author wrote, his ineptitude surrounding the Harry and Meghan saga has effectively turned the couple into the disruptors they were feared to become in the first place. And so much of it could have been prevented, said a mutual family friend. King Charles was advised to swallow his pride by the late Queen, claims the book, Image, Max Mumby slash Indigo slash Getty Images. For so long Harry had made it clear that he and Meghan simply wanted to be heard. That they wanted the opportunity to sit down and talk through the past, from both perspectives, and find a way to move forward. For Harry, it was about seeking accountability and, where appropriate, apologies. Stubborn as ever, it was the one thing Charles refused to give them even if it meant risking damage to the crown. Scobie claims that a Clarence House staff member said Charles was even encouraged by his late mother Queen Elizabeth to swallow his pride but instead chose to say nothing and turn the other way.